Hey, what's going on uh, YouTube? This is uh, Ray Jr. coming with Fanatics, and I have my little helper right here, my son Mason. So this video is uh, another CGC of books I received while I was deployed, and uh, as you see, he can barely hold in his laughter. He likes helping me out and stuff, but uh, some books I got while I was deployed, of course. I did, did a few videos since I've been back, and then I can explain uh, a, a few of the books. So... We'll go ahead and get started. We'll go ahead and have Mason hold up this first one. As you see, tilt it to the side a little bit, Mason. It's a glare. Do it like this. Okay. All right. So right here is all new Wolverine number one. Now this sketch is by a buddy of mine I know, Jeff West. Turn it over in the back, Mason. You can see he drew female Thor. Knows I like the females drawn a little thick. So you can see that right there. You can turn it back to the front, Mace. And hold it right hold it right there. No, stand it up. There you go, bud. And then there's a uh, female Wolverine right there, X-23. Now, the big thing about this book is this book was CBCS graded at an 8.5. Yes, 8.5. And then I sent it in to the CGC and we had Mace. And you see it came back a 9.8. So I was like ecstatic with that. So hey, can't go wrong. Next up, we got Civil War. Can I break this one? Number one. What's up, Mace? Yeah, it kind of broke this No, it's one. not broke. Come on, hold it up, but I thought I did. Uh, as you see, this is a. We got Red Sonja in the front. I'm a big Red Sonja fan. And this is a kind of a homage to uh, What If Number 10. Conan the Barbarian battled uh, the Mighty Thor. So Red Sonja will be playing the Conan the Barbarian role and flip it on the back, Mace. And Jane Foster, female type Thor, is playing the Thor role. So, of course, it's bigger than what the cover is, you know because of the artwork but this is another one done by Jeff West I've got a few commissions from him a couple of prints that he's did for me which is pretty nice turn it back to the front mace and this was a hold it up 9.6 and let's see help him out here to straighten it up 9.6 alright next last sketch that I got from Jeff he did uh, Justice League number 16, 9.8 of Power Girl. You see right there. Flip it over on the back, Mace. Stand it up. And there we go. Harley Quinn. So it's pretty much Power Girl has Harley Quinn by the ankle right there and it carrying it off in the air. Pretty nice sketch. Like I said, 9.8. Very static on that one. All right. <clears throat> Ooh, excuse me. Uh, this is a uh, Thor God of Thunder number two, uh, signed by Jason Aaron. Let's Jason. see, right there, nine point two. Um, my man's uh, Tommy, Thomas Thomas uh, Mack uh, sent him this book, and uh, Jason Aaron was uh, at a con in Kansas City. And he got it signed for me and sent it in and got it graded. So I greatly appreciate that. So 9.2 on that one. All right, set that one to the side, Mace. Nah, you had to do the back. There's no sketch on the back. But thank you anyway. All right, next up, I got Thor 297. 9.6 signed. Let's see if we find the signature right there. Roy Thomas, yes, the great Roy Thomas, signed this book for me, and I like to give a big shout out to uh, Manny NYC and uh, Anthony Port for getting this done for me. Uh, one of the cons they went to down there in New York because <coughs> they knew I wouldn't be, you know, wasn't able to go, so they went ahead and uh, squared me away on that one. So that was two ninety seven, and then the other one they got done for me here. 
is issue 298. It came back at 8.0. Uh, Roy Thomas sign right there. And then that's the cover. That's the cover right there. So pretty nice. All right. Some more Thor books, of course. And these are all the variants for Thor number one. Uh, this is another one that I sent uh, my buddy Thomas Mack, and he got done for me. Signed by Jason Aaron. As you see, it's a uh, Hastings edition. And it's got Deadpool with Thor, Lady Thor on the front. So that was pretty nice. The next one is a Midtown Comics edition. 9.8. Signed by Jason Aaron again. Pretty nice right there. Sorry for the glare. And then another one is another Thor, number one. This is a Mile High Comics uh, edition. Pays homage to the Journey to Mission, number 83, first appearance of Thor. Thought that was pretty nice right there. Let's see. All right, now getting on to some some Odies. We got Journey in the Mystery number ninety three, origin and first appearance of Radioactive Man. Came back at three point oh. Some of the classic covers right there. And hold it up straight, bud. There you go. Thanks. Appreciate it. So there we go with that one. We got uh, number 94, Journey to Mystery. Came back at 3.5. This is where I think uh, Loki had tricked uh, Thor into thinking uh, that the Earthlings, humans, were, uh, were bad or whatever. So, nice little cover on that one. I have a Journey to Mystery number 95, 3.0. Hold it up straight, bud. There you go. Thank you. So Thor versus Thor. That's a pretty nice cover right there. It is beat up. As you can see around the edges right there. But hey, it is what it is. And then last but not least. You see it where it's all beat up? But last but not least, I got a Journey to Mystery. Number 102. First appearance of... Balder, Hela, and Sif, and it's a Zarko appearance. So, first appearance of Hela and Lady Sif, and uh, Balder the Brave, 5.5. But you look down here at the corner right here, it was signed by Stan Lee beforehand. So, I went ahead and requested just for the blue label, and it came back at 5.5. So, you know, if there's already a signature on the book. Uh, you can request a blue label, but it'll knock the grade down. I don't know how much. I don't know if it's a whole grade, but I was still happy with a 5.5 for this uh, 1964 book. And like I said, the first appearance of Hella, Balder the Brave, and uh, Lady Sif. So I'm very, very happy, uh, especially with my Thor collection. So that is it. I want to thank my man, Mason. Say hi to the camera, Mason. I want to thank my man, Mason, for helping me out with this video. He asked me, could he help? And I said, why not? Uh, that way, maybe this will uh, get him into collecting as well. Uh, if not, then it is what it is. So, I hope everybody enjoys the video. Go ahead and uh, click like, comment, and go ahead and subscribe if you haven't subscribed. So, until next time, go ahead and tell everybody goodbye, Mason. Alright, so until next time, we're out.